Welcome back guys. Today I'm going to be doing something pretty unfair. In the last video, I compared two of my Lasco Weather Shield motors to each other. In today's video, I'm going to be comparing the old uh, full-size McMillan motor, shaded pull motor, to the modern Weather Shield motor that is in this Airflex fan right here. So this is the Airflex box fan that the motor initially came in. I swapped it back into here. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to do what I did in the last video. I'm going to run this motor with this blade set to see how fast it spins. Then I'm going to swap in the McMillan motor and see if there's any performance difference, which there definitely will be. If the 1.1 amp motor was faster than this, it's going to be quite unfair for the newer Weather Shield motor. It's going to get mogged by this uh, McMillan motor. So, so I'm going to do what I did in the previous video where I ran the individual speeds to compare uh, the two motors. So I'm going to start this one on high speed, then I'll shut it off, start it on medium speed, then I'll shut it off and start it on low speed. And I'm going to do the same thing with this motor, but I'm going to edit the video. That way you can compare directly between the speeds. So I'm going to edit the video so you can see this one on high speed, and then you can see this one on high speed, then you can see medium speed and low speed and compare directly with each other. I guess it'll make more sense actually to start it from the back so that way there's no wind stream or anything getting in the way. All right, now we got the McMillan motor swapped in. Let's see what the difference is.
That is not even fair. That is insane. And the bearings are stiff too, it seems. It's kind of it's kind of strange. Maybe they're not stiff. That's not even a competition. Like we don't even have to really discuss who won here. That's not even close. Honestly, even the 1.1 amp motor probably doesn't stand a chance with this blade set. So it appears on a with a heavier blade set, or at least a blade set that has more pitch on it and puts more weight on the motor, these shaded pole motors pack a punch, man. They bulletproof in terms of performance. Yeah, honestly, I was not expecting such a massive performance difference between this and the modern Weather Shield motor. That is insane. Think about that for a second. Put that into context. If you went from that newer modern Weather Shield motor to this McMillan motor, you would gain so much more performance. Now, unfortunately, it consumes over 2.2 times the amount of power, but you are rewarded with more performance. And not to mention the uh, McMillan motor has a much better, much larger range in the speeds. High is extremely ferocious. Medium speed is chill. And then low speed is like, you can't even tell the fan is on. So you're rewarded by going vintage or older in this case, definitely. Even the 1.1 amp PSC motor doesn't stand a chance against this McMillan motor. However, of course, there's that caveat that the 1.1 amp PSC motor will absolutely destroy this if you put on a lighter blade set. I've tested that before. I can test it again if you guys want me to uh, test it and you guys want to see it. Let me know. But yeah, I think that was very interesting to see. I did not know the McMillan motor could get up like that. All right, I decided to grab the 1.1 amp PSC Weather Shield motor just so I could put this performance into context a little bit more. Okay, it's not as much slower as I expected. I expected this to get curb stomped by that McMillan motor. It's still slower. I expected way worse from the 1.1 amp motor. So, in conclusion, this is the slowest motor of the bunch. This PSC motor is, is in the middle somewhere, and the McMillan motor reigns supreme. However, if you toss on a lighter, thinner blade set, the 1.1 amp PSC motor will destroy the McMillan motor. I've tested that before in a previous video. Yeah, it spins a lot faster on the 1.1 amp motor. Not sure why that is, but it's kind of interesting. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you found this video interesting. Let me know what you guys think. See y'all next time.